One of the most famous stories from the Bible is the story of Daniel in the lion's den. Daniel worked closely with King Darius, the Medo-Persian emperor who had conquered Babylon. Many other noblemen in the kingdom became jealous of Daniel's closeness to the king and devised a plan to trap him. Since Daniel was a good man, they knew they would not catch him doing something inherently wrong. They knew they could only trap him if they made Daniel's religious beliefs illegal. These men manipulated the king into passing a law that made it illegal for anyone to pray to any god besides Darius himself for a month. Because Daniel was a devout Jew, he would never obey this law and continued to pray to Yahweh, the God of Israel. For his so-called crime, Daniel was to be executed by being thrown into a den full of hungry lions. The king realized how he had been manipulated into passing a law that would harm his friend and could not eat or sleep through the night after Daniel was thrown into the lion's den. In the morning, Darius returned to the lion's den only to find that God had sent an angel to protect Daniel from the lions. The lions did not even attempt to attack him. Because he trusted in God and maintained his integrity, Daniel was saved from his enemies. This is a famous story that has inspired many Jews and Christians. It encourages us to trust that God will save us from difficult circumstances. But there is an even larger message we can gain from Daniel in the lion's den. Daniel was only serving the king in the first place because his people, the Jews, had been captured from Israel, taken from their homeland, and forced to live in exile in Babylon. They were people trying to learn how to live out their faith in God, even while in a strange land. The story of Daniel demonstrates how the mighty powers of the world often turn against God and his people. In fact, later on in his book, Daniel actually uses lions as a symbol of the kingdom of Babylon itself. Daniel being thrown into the den of lions is a smaller picture of how God's people were exiled in a world full of wild, beastly powers that oppose God. In spite of these circumstances, Daniel says that God has a plan to save his people from these powers. Daniel foresaw that a new power was coming to the world and that one day, God would overturn the power of the world and establish a new kind of kingdom. Until the day when God's plan is fully realized, his people should not run from lions, but stand and boldly face them, trusting in the one who is by their side, even in exile.